Welcome back guys, Swain here, and today I'm going to sh show you an updated version on how to install Joyplay and get Inf Pokemon Infinite Fusion running with the latest versions. So, step one, we open up Chrome, we want to go to Joyplay, the official website, you don't want to go from here. Why, well, yes, it has some newer versions, not the latest. But you can always welcome to check out the Discord for any new updates and help tips. That's always good to go to. Okay, we'll go back. Where we want to go is their Patreon. Go down, go to the first tab. We want to install the Joyplay 1.20.027 Joyplay. And the 1.20.28 RPG Maker plugin. Yes, we want both of them. Put them download and download. And we go to Infinite Fusion. Okay, I like the Pokemon Community page. So all links for everything will be down below in the description for you to check out yourself. Okay, go to the media file. If you're unsure really what to do, you can do the introductions there. But we want fresh. So, there's two versions here, Dynamic and Preloaded. Dynamic is the game with some basic sprites. Why Preloaded has, oh, well, like 90% of the sprites. Except all the new ones they're adding, you may want to add in yourself if you want to. But anyway, for starters, we recommend downloading the Dynamic one. Click on it, it will take you to Media Fusion. I don't want to download you. I don't want to download you. Okay, that will download. Take a little bit, depending on your internet. But also, while we're here, I suggest you also check out their Discord. There'll be a link here somewhere. Join the community, the Discord. Check that out. Very helpful. Okay, that should give that time to download. Then we want to go to your file folder. Then find where you stole, installed Joyplay. Uh, downloads, I keep all my APK separate. We want to install Joyplay. You want to install update, I've already got it installed, so I don't, care, I don't need to. Then we want to install the plugin. Yes, 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 that will install, take a little bit. All right. And to prep for getting, uh, extracting Pokemon Infinite Fusion, go to the Play Store. And we want to download the Archiver. The handy little app that will help extract the game nicely and simply and hopefully not with any files. That is a problem when it comes to some things. So download and install that one, all three of course. Then we want to open up the archiver. Find where you downloaded Infinite Fusion to. Tap on the file, extract your archiver name, and then let that run through. It will probably take about mm, 10, 20 minutes or so. Or if you get the uh, preloaded one, it may take a couple of hours. All right, that's done. Now we want to open up Joyplay. So we go add a game, choose Rexy file. Oh, I don't have it in downloads, I have it in game. Do that, open that one up. You want the XC, do that. And what you want, you can chuck your version if you want to. We have 5.2.1. Pick the picture and done. So now, if this screen pops up, you want to hit download. Take you to the right web page. Scroll down and we want to download the RPG Maker XP1. Click on it, it will download. Then we go back to it, we'll go choose, 
Now we need to find the said downloaded game, download file, the in downloads. It will be labeled XP RTP 104X.exe. Click on that, click choose. It will install and take a little bit. All right, and that's successfully done. So that that issue out of the way, and now the game should run smoothly. Let's try that again. Loading, loading. It would only take a little bit the first time it loads. So do that to make sure you got that. Slow, mine's fast because I've already done stuff. And yes, then you can go in and play the game. I do recommend you go to options and change the text entry to cursor. Handy it, always handy. And then you can play the game as as nice. Okay, a couple little thing, other little alterations you need to do if you have problems. So let's go first, long press again. We'll go edit. If make sure the game type is RPG Maker MKXP-Z. Otherwise you'll get more, more compatibility errors. Another thing you want to do, long press, optimize maps. It'll come up, ask you to hit convert. I've already done it, it will take a while. Hit convert and it will convert the maps into a more optimal format for joy play. And yes, and with that all out of the way, you should be able to somewhat play Infinite Fusion or any other fan game you may wish to play. I have a few on my phone as you may have seen through this tutorial. Do I play them? I have started them. I mainly play them on my computer, so yeah, I don't really have much use on my phone. So you may also notice my cut, my buttons are different from others, because I have changed them in the configuration. Yeah, you can change them if you'd like, but you don't have to. You use enter as a, enter as a, uh, enter as a, escape as, ex, escape as a B. But yeah, the main buttons you use anyway are C, X, uh, C, is mainly your menu, X, so C, C is A, X is B, Z, you know, Z is B, something like that. try and help you out but anyway all i hope this is all helpful to you and you know again all links will be down below in the description but for now thank you all for watching and i'll catch you all on the next one bye